Alright, who's this guy? That is a Sentinel and can be a Void Knight, Forge Guard or a Paladin. Okay. Very interesting. Let me put the chat in a different location so you guys can see. I'll put you guys here for now. Um, okay. Um, back. And this one seems to be probably my type of class. Looks really nice. Last Epoch login. Rogue. Oh, I'm a rogue kind of guy, you know? Flurry. Make flurries. Shurikens. Shifting. Umbral Blades, Smoke Bomb, and Ballista. However, I'm pretty sure Rogue is going to be stupidly weak against hits, right? We're gonna die real fast. Mage. I'm not a really big mage guy, but they're usually OP. Mm hmm. Who can he go up? Disintegrate. Who's this guy? That is a primalist. Okay. Uh -huh. Doesn't look too interesting to me. And who are you? Necromancer? I'm pretty sure that's a necro yeah, necromancer, of course. Is everyone playing this class? Is it OP, just like in Diablo 4? Probably, right? Guys, it is obvious what we play. Right? I love this class already. Now, can I not go male version? Do I have to play a woman? Like, nothing against women, okay? But I just like male characters more. Whatever. Okay, 77. Hardcore. Solo cell found. Solo found character? Solo account found. Solo character. I think we go solo account found because if we find cool items that don't belong to us, I don't know how the loot in the game works, we will be able to share that with other accounts or other characters which we'll probably need because i'm pretty sure i'll die at some point right i've never played the game all right create character yay let's go <laughs> nice solo characters through ssf whatever that was darkness why do you skip this guys how can i watch the intro video again do I need to make a new character? In the beginning, there was darkness. Only the terror, myself, and the void. I was content with nothing. She dreamt of light, of life, of humanity. We disagreed, and yet... In her world, there were gods. Majossa of the desert. Largon of the sea. Rye of the endless skies. And Hierot of the frozen tundra. But fate stole Lekera away. Without her, it's gonna be the there poor was conflict. Right. Then wars. In the end, it was Rye who sought to outshine the sun that would pull the world into his flame. Caught within Rye's gaze were the Keepers, an order sworn to protect Etera's memory and the power it still holds. They were joined by someone unexpected, a traveler Willing to walk into the flames of war. But why? Was it honor they sought? Power? Redemption? Or was this fate? Perhaps. But no story is quite that simple. Okay. Time to leave the shelter behind me. W <laughs> is uh, nothing. Q is. Uh, flurry, okay, make flurry. Oh, lag, okay. Okay, I'm already a good gamer. Good. What is this? Is this something we can use? No. Cool. Do we have some sort of dodge? Can I, like, dodge somewhere? Dodge roll? No? 
And do I have normal attack or right click? Yeah, I do. Okay, so basically you cannot change the left click. It's always bound to moving, which I... It's a fun, this is something I really like. When you have an ability on your left mouse button, you oftentimes you misclick or you accidentally click on an enemy and then you attack instead of moving, which is really annoying. What is this? In the hands of the fallen messenger, you find a letter from the Keeper's Council. It, it is addressed Trevor, to you. Our Heoborian allies informed us that you will attend the peace talks. Raya's war has reached our lands, and we are in need of aid. Okay. As Keepers, we avoid conflict. We're dedicated to the goddess Atera. He wishes to destroy us and steal Atera's legacy. Mm -hmm. We can't let that happen. Okay, some person would like to destroy help. the Keepers, and we are part of the Keepers. All right, you don't do anything anymore, right? The follow messenger, you reach. You need to reach the keepers, okay? Rogue is so much more impactful already. Hey guys, we got four gold. We're rich. Oh wow! Okay. Gameplay mechanics, short ball. Can I use that immediately? C. Oh, C is my stuff. Inventory. What is this? Base attack rate 1.5, forging potential and 12 bow damage. Can I use it? Uh huh. I can't use Q, right? LOL, I can use a bow and fury! That is OP! Already a bow. So. Damn. Uh, but bow is kind of trash. Oops. Bow is kind of trash because this has AoE. LOL, I have a blue item! Dude, what was that? Lightning resistance vitality. I could just use it? Is there no identifying in this game? Okay. And we got a new attack. It's called Shurikens. Okay. That costs mana. Okay. Ah. Ouch. Okay, wait a minute. Is this just damage? It does physical damage and it scales with dexterity. No identifying. You don't need to carry scrolls or the portal. There's no identification needed. Okay, cool. Oh, wow. This looks really good. If I have to, like, compare this with Path of Exile, this looks better than PoE. What do you think looks better? This one or PoE? close but I, when I see this cave man this looks really good it looks clean that's what I like in PoE you have all of this fog ar all around right and makes it difficult to see sometimes it's a stylistic choice I know that they could remove the fog if they want to but this I like the cleanness of this swapping skills wait you can swap skills in your action bar left clicking on them using the flat menu to change the skill you have okay can i uh, always attack without moving is there a way to do that move to melee attack enemies that are out of range this one is it get rid of this oh this is so much better jade ring Ooh, dodge rating okay where can i see my dodge rating oh wow that's a lot of stuff defense this is <laughs> you can't see it very well you know but this is the typical poe interface right see that all of these stats it's typical for poe as well wow they tell me what it does wait challenge to receive a glancing blow let me do that challenge uh, chance to receive a glancing blow grants a chance only when receiving a glancing blow when you take a hit you take 35 percent less damage from glancing blows okay oh there we go you can dodge a hit wait i have eight percent okay i have eight percent okay i see now. man i'm enjoying this so far this this character is really strong you can't really touch me God, I love this ability. This is so... It's like cleave. But it's good. And the, the character handling fits so much better than in PoE. The bodies are burned beyond recognition. They were fleeing. Okay. Wait, they are... Hey? Huh? They fight against each other? Really? 
I never use this, nor do I use auto attacks. My mana is... Wait, this doesn't even cost mana. Lol? Ow. Oh, 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 wait, wait. How do I use a potion? Oh, oh okay, okay. I gotta, gotta level up. Holy! Oh goodness. Okay, armor, armor. Okay, this one's better. Increased mana. Wow, that was close. When you Who arrived, are you? was there a family? Everything all right? My mistake. They were cornered, and there were so many. I can handle Ospricks. I told them to stay back, to let me handle it, and they left. What good are we if we can't? <sighs> Sorry, I just met you and. It's been a long road. Are you also I can tell. Here peace talks? I don't know why I'm here, bro. I literally just spawned into the game. Good. Because so am I. Name's Grail. Since we're both headed the same direction, why don't we go together? It looks like this game is a little bit more story driven, am I right? I wonder which of us will take down more Ospricks. Come, let me watch you fight. Oh, we have a companion now, lol. Cool. It's like in Diablo. Oh, wow. He's freezing that. Wow. Damn. He's strong. He did 50 damage. Bruh. Oh, wait. Look at this. We have this plus. What is this? Passive system information. Oh god. Now we go. Now we're talking. This is... I've heard about this and I've seen this before. You can choose abilities and then make these abilities stronger. And I think I want to make McFlurry strong because, man, this one's really good. Gaining passive note points. Gain passive note points by leveling up. Yep. Completing quests. Mastery classes. Initially, you may only place points in your base class tree. You will have the opportunity to choose a master class during your adventure. Once you choose a master class, you will gain access to the left section of the mastery. So that's probably this one, right? We probably go play tent, so that looks really cool. <laughs> yeah. Only one mastery pack character. I wonder if you can respec. What is this? Swift assassin, attack speed, physical damage. I can choose whatever I want. Dodge rating, poison resistance. No, 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 do, uh, do ask me to confirm. Hey. Dude. In Path of Exile, they asked you to confirm and I was like, okay, there's going to be a confirm button that comes up here. Bruh, what could I have gotten? Dexterity? Health. Poison resist. Shit. You can respect passive points easy in a bit. Okay. Oh, my, at least we have dodge now, I guess, huh? But I wanted to have dexterity because main stat seems to be the best choice. I'm pretty sure dexterity also scales evasion. Uh, this game has the same issues, I think. Yeah. Or maybe not. Right. I guess we wait until we could respect. I mean, whatever. <gasps> Ooh, skill system. Wait. Ooh. Shit. How do I open up this? Uh, viewing argument. You wait. Viewing augment trees. Click a skill. Use a new skill. Click on an action bar slot to access the skill selection panel. Oh, wow. I have two more skills here. Okay. Specializing in skills. You can specialize in up to five skills by clicking... No, by clicking an unlocked specialization slot located above. Which... Unlock as you level up. Yeah, we got one. Specializing in a skill will allow you to gain skill points for that skill by earning experience, which you can use to empower and augment it. Some skills do not have an augment tree available yet. Wait. I, saw, I thought this was a release. Uh, how can you call it a release if n some abilities just not work yet? Okay, McFlurry. Oh, Flurry has increased attack speed. Flurry does damage per point. Also, either attack speed or damage. 
Wait, isn't 8% damage just 8% more? And this is only 3% more? But we are faster. So that's nice. Flurry is now challenge... challenge Flurry is now a challenge... Challenge... Flurry is now a channeled ability that costs 5 mana per second to maintain. Do not regenerate... You do not regenerate mana while channeling. Mm, Flurry leeches a portion of the damage dealt. Kill Flurry have a chance to release a kinetic blood burst. Um, oh wow, poison strike chance. I think we go with poison. I like the idea of poison, so we go with damage and the poison. Maximum attack speed, attack speed per point. You have increased attack speed for each hit. Damn, this is so cool. We go to damage, damage. Wait, I can respec here, but I can't respec the skill tree? Wanted, nah, whatever. We can, we can respec in a second, anyways. Okay. Oh, yeah, right. There's other abilities. What is this? Oh, wow. This is shift. And uh, this one throws an acid flask, explodes, dealing physical damage on impact, poisoning, uh, poisoning enemies, reducing their armor. Damage per second. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay. It's poisoned. Where'd you learn to fight? Can I stack? Lol. <laughs> I'm like this alchemist. This is really cool. We're gonna uncover the entire map. It's like torchlight. <laughs> this is cool. Can I dash down here? Is this how it works? Kiwi is cooler in this regard. I can't dash, right? Through the wall. But maybe there is a leap. Something like that allows you to go through these walls. Quick, oh, wow. We're gonna poison him to the maximum. Watch. Four stacks. Oh, it, wow. Look at that. Good gamer. I have no mana. Um, what do you want to do? Cool. Do we have an increased bow attack speed quiver? Very interesting. And this is giving me health and nothing else. This is giving me 19 health. Okay. What is this? The keepers have proven difficult to track. But my observations revealed the truth. Their camps are neither chosen nor abandoned on a whim. There's a pattern to how they scurry. I instructed my soldiers to investigate the abandoned camps. Mm -hmm. Invariably, they're near shrines devoted to the eldest of gods. Each one was as empty as the last, save for meager signs of the Keeper's presence. They're not guarding the ruins. They're traveling between them, over and over. They must be moving with them. It'll be as simple as burning these vermin to ash. Who is this guy? Wills it. This guy is someone that doesn't like the keepers, I guess. And that's why he... I don't know. He's spying on them. But we just killed him. So he should be no longer a problem. Quest completed. Gold and experience. Uh-huh. Interesting how they display experience as bow and arrows. Or... Uh, what is that? Dagger and arrows? Alright, let's see here. Can I respect now? Please? Yeah, it's kind of annoying that you can't respect. What is this? Another he one? wants offered protection. More than protection. An alliance. But the truth is, we know little about him. Or his people. Why should the council should trust him? One. He's one of the gods. Atera made him just as she made us keepers, and gave him a role by her side. He's the guardian of his people, and he does his job well. Prospect 2. He cares for his people. Like the goddess herself, he extends his heart to all who need support. He forms alliances, wanting to stand united. 
Meanwhile, Raya wishes to tear this world asunder. Prospect three. His people are warriors. Herr Borean fighters put ours to shame. We fight because it is necessary while they relish in it. I'll take on being... Thus, I propose we accept this alliance. It is not in our nature, but we keepers have a sacred duty to uphold. Without Herod's help... Okay, I've never understood the story on the fruitless. first part or the first thing. Uh, before we go to the... I guess we go to... Nah, we might trigger a quest. I really want to respect. I want to get dexterity. I'm assuming we can get it here, right? Where the brain is. Cause big brain move. Hello, traveler. Respecialize my mastery point allocations. Okay. Respect one point. Cost gold? Hey, why? Come on, man. Dexterity and health. Attack speed. Physical damage. Your melee throwing and ball skills have increased attack speed and damage. That one sounds so good. What does dexterity give me? Each point of dexterity adds 4 dodge rating. And improves skills that rely on it. Yeah, so that's the best one to take. 100%. Now don't click it again. No, no, no. We won't click it again. So this seems to be the world map. Wow, look how big this is. What? What? They really did a good job, man. Holy. Where did he go? Oh, did he move? Let's check on this guy. He has weapons and armor, I was, would assume. Hell yeah. Let's check our damage. We have 10 melee damage. This one's 20 and it only costs 24? Ooh. <gasps> wait a Excuse me. Wait a minute. Crit chance. Wait, it costs... Hey. How is this cheaper when it's blue? Shift, right click to buy. Okay, we buy this. We buy this. Dodge rating. Yeah, sure. Let's get a ring. Holy. Wait, I can't use it? Why not? Hey? It's a two-handed sword, two-handed sword, man. He scammed me. Oh, it literally says two hundred. Uh, get the um, whatever. Uh, shift right-click to sell. This is stash, right? No. I've heard that you can have unlimited stash tabs in this game. Is that right? How is that even possible? I thought you could only have six. Aren't there like some actual physical programming limitations? Sounds like this is where we part ways. Good luck out there. You work for Hero? I don't Herod? work for him. I'm his champion. Why? Oh wow, we triggered him. Champion, what it does means that mean? I've fought hard and climbed my way to the top. Ah yeah. Mm -hmm. Hirot himself taught me everything I know. As such, I dedicate myself to him, an extension of his will. So, like, can I make him mad, but why? Because he saved me. When I lacked purpose, he was there. Mm -hmm. He made me what I am. And what's the that? The person who's going to end this war. Take Raye down. And make him rue the day he dared mess with us. So, Raye is this... Like, there were four gods or something. Four bosses that we have to kill, right? Is Raye one of them? Or did I miss something? Grail was just telling me of your battle. I am Lena, mm -hmm. one of the Keeper's Council. It's the Phoenix Fire guy. Ah, okay, okay, interesting. Mm -hmm. One of two. There should be more of us here. They're gone. Balthus and I remain, and he's not here. As such, I must ask for your help. Balthus is busy checking on our sacred artifacts. We're protectors of Atera's history. And right now, they're in danger. Not much, I'm afraid. We'll discuss it after our alliance. You okay. are, and I'm sorry, but this is how it must be. Their secrecy of keeps course, them safe. Of course, we are the hero, we are the main character. Of Even course. now, the Osprics swarm all of our sacred vaults. I've already asked Grail to check one down in the uh -huh. mountains. There I get is it now. up north, where Balthus is. 
Could you make sure he's safe? There's word of a drake patrolling the skies. So the Ospreks are from this Phoenix guy and they are attacking... Uh, I don't know who, who the other boss is or the other god. They can, but... Baltus is impulsive. I worry he'll do something stupid. Guys, she's a keeper. <laughs> you get it? She's a keeper. You don't trust sure him? Sure I do. With your help. Indeed she is, yeah. Um, then our alliance is secure? What are, what are these questions? I don't even know her. What, why are we talking about alliance? Why is she asking me for help? Eh? Do this and our alliance is secure. We'll lend our aid to Heoborea's army. Aha, so, okay, I wonder who Heoborea is. Sounds like I have work to do. Alright, we can go either to the right or to the left. Let's check the right here. What is this? The fortress gardens. Okay, what is the... Enter the fortress gardens. Now, what is to the right? I like going where the game tells me not to go. Okay, I can't go there because it's conveniently placed people and boxes. Sure, bro. Mm. Sorry, we are under orders to not let anyone in or out. Ospreks have been sighted in the highlands. Okay. That's it. We'll go here. So what is the maximum level of this game, guys? Level 50? 100? You can now use your portal to return to the last visited town. How do I do that? T. Ah, okay. T is portal. That's nice. It's familiar. Oh, wow. That's a lot of... That's a lot of monsters. Oh, wow. Look at the deeps. Holy. <laughs> Lol. They don't do anything. <laughs> Lol. Oh, these are blue. No, they are not. Too easy. It's true. It's true. Yeah, auto attacks really suck. Aha, I can have two health potions. What if I use one? Interesting. Oh, Quill Hog. You guys remember this from Diablo? Literally Quill Rats here. Convenient name. Ooh, we got a new skill. What is this? Puncture. Okay. An extended melee stab or piercing bow attack that has a 30% chance to inflict bleed on hit. Bleeds inflicted by Puncture have 30% increased duration. This is OP. Look at this. I'm just dealing massive AOE damage. Holy. Oh wow, Puncture is even more crazy. What the fuck? Look at this. Boom, boom, boom. Damn. Get down! Uh oh. Build guide. It's too advanced, I can't show you. Huh? What is this? Look at this. It's <laughs> it's tossing up there. Lol? Wait a minute. Can I hit this? So far, it's definitely a little bit slower than Path of Exile, but it's to be expected. Path of Exile... Hey, I didn't click on this! I wasn't done! Wait a minute. Whenever you switch the zones, it looks like the game creates an entirely new instance. It doesn't reuse anything. I wanted to check whether I missed something here, you know? I don't want to miss anything. Oh, I love this. I love this ability. This is so cool, man. <laughs> I killed all of these. Man, this is awesome. Let's go. Let's. Kind of sad that the uh, very beginning that the server issues uh, ruined the launch for many people. 
Very sad because the game really plays very well. It's so fun. I'm having a blast so far. Now I'm still wondering what am I supposed to do here? But I suppose at some point we're gonna encounter a boss. What, who's this? Hey, who are you? Invader? Solar Invader? Sorry? What are you guarding? Oh, well, they're tanky. Can I go here? Mm. Would have been cool if there was a chest. Loot will disappear as well, so be careful, Cakes. Oh, okay. Okay, thank you. I kinda, kinda bullshit. That did not hit me. <laughs> Wait a minute. Potion slots. Oh, three potion slots. I have to say, having left click only be left click and that it's not even a question you can't i'm pretty sure you can't rebind left click you always move with this is so awesome it is ingenious game design and i think every arpg should do it like that because accidentally clicking on an enemy while moving is deadly and it's annoying you stutter step a lot one second guys there's someone standing right next to me one second. Mm -hmm. Wife needs help for a second. If I die here, the game sucks. Be right back real quick. If, if I die here, the game is terrible. And it's her fault. The game's awesome. I like the game already. Chair 77, the best streamer. All right. Uh, while we are here, how about we spend a couple more, spo more points? How many do we have? Two. Hmm... Now, I'm assuming I can only go here if I put a point here, right? Which means I have to put a point here to get this, right? Right? It requires... No, wait, I don't. Uh, we can respec, it's fine. We go for dexterity. Uh, I, I'll continue here. Wait. Can we put skill points in a skill? Aha, Flurry's first strike has a chance to inflict poison and bleed on the second. Okay, we do that. Always go for the dex, really? Is it really that good? Oh, look, a chest, right? Aha, boots, gloves, and a, sp Ooh, a spear. Is this one better? No, less damage per second. Chance to shock on hit. Poison resistance. Movement speed. Wait, maybe this one's better because it gives me movement speed. And this one? Oh, wait. What do we hold? Control. We get less movement speed, but we get lightning resistance. I take it. Yeah. Dodge rating. This one has 24 dodge rating. This one has 12. Get this. Right. I wonder if I can even use this spear. Oh, I can. Oh, wow. Damn. Look at these guys. Oh! Now, what I'm... What I think is happening. I could be wrong here. There's four gods. And those four gods wage war against each other. That's what it seems like to me at the moment. I could be wrong. Of course. But otherwise, it makes no sense because they all attack each other. The fire guys attack the nature guys, the angel guys attack the nature guys, but also the fire guys. Oh, I've got a sword! Hey! One second. A sword. Increased stun chance? All right, we move on. I think we have everything unlocked now. Grace period. You are invulnerable for a brief period of time. That is great. Shit did not hit me, man. Looks like the enemies are getting more dangerous now. 
Looks like I need HP. Easy. Too easy. Uh, you say that, but it doesn't look easy to me. Like, for example, these angel guys, they would attack the fire guys. And the fire guys would attack the nature guys. Hey, I clicked down here! What is a dice? What is a dice? I just found a dice. Increased critical strike chance. Okay. And what is this? Leather mask. Armor poison resistance. Mm -hmm. And you attack all the guys? Yep. Yeah, that's a bit odd. I still don't understand why. Can bleed stack? Oh, it can. Okay, so 100% bleed chance would mean we can always bleed and it stacks multiple times. Huh? Oh, I'm full inventory. Hmm. I go back to town and sell everything. If I go to the town portal, will I go back? Huh? Can I go back to the point where I used the portal? Okay, cool. Nice. Oh, wow. Look at this. Chance to ignite on hit. What is this? There's another dagger that gives 9 melee damage and crit chance. Increased throwing attack speed. We get both of these. Yep. Alright, we're strong now. Control key is absolute losers, am I right? Control key? You can have 100%, more than 100% bleed chance for a chance for more than once. Okay. Man, this game loads so slowly. I'm so scared sometimes that I don't teleport. I'm in trouble. Guys, I'm in trouble. Just go to settings and set compare items to on. God, I'm obliterating these guys. Yeah, settings. Compare items. It's gotta be in gameplay, right? Loot filter. No filter. Manage loot filters. Auto compare items. What is that? Floating player name? Nah, we don't need that. Wow, look at him. He's poisoned. He's bleeding. He's burning. <laughs> Ooh. Poison resistance, dodge, mana, increased mana, health regeneration. <gasps> health regeneration? Ah, oh, we got a teleporter here. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. I was scared. Nice. I love this. I just love this. This is so good. It feels so good. Cinder strike. Okay. All right. Let's see here. Dex. Uh, hey, hey. I want to go for this. I'm not using it anymore, though. Uh, 
I want to use this acid flask. That one looks really cool. Acid flask has an additional chance to poison an enemy on hit. 25% per point. Acid flask, flask deals more damage. Multiplicative with other modifiers. 10% more. Slow chance. Slow duration. Mm -hmm. So it's either slow. Poison chance. Or more damage. Increased throwing speed. Chance to shed enemy poison resistance. You know what? We go for poison. We go for maximum po Why can I not go here? Why can I not go here? Zero out of four. Eh? Oh, I need... To eh? Requires one point. Eh? Hey, I don't have uh, hey. zero points. I only have one point. You need more points in prize skill. Wait, I only have one point. You need to level abilities. Respect reduces the level. Ah, aha. Okay. Oh, well, that's a bit annoying. But uh, uh, okay, what level was I here? Oh, Sag. Okay. What is this? There's too many of them. Heo, Borean, Soldier. Are you alright? They've invaded some of the old storage. They're building something there. I'll look into it. Stay safe. Okay. Well, it's a quest to go into the storage. I wanted to go there anyways. This feels like Diablo 3. Uh, you guys remember the part where you have to go into the stone keep? And you go on top of the uh, fortress walls and you have to make sure that all of the siege weapons are active or something. You have to like, you know, activate the le letters, levers, the siege weapons, and you are being attacked by demons. Did I just walk back? It's interesting how I can burn a phoenix, but I guess it's a video game and you get yelled at by the guards if you miss a milliseconds of lever pulling yeah <laughs> exactly what is this oh wow i can attack that what is this right here grand scritchens oh that's a shrine Okay. It's almost like the shrine event in Diablo 4. Where one shrine would give you an additional bonus. Oh, 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 oh get out of there. Dude. Wait, this is super easy. Intelligence shard? What is this? Augments an item to grant a new property or improve an existing one. Huh. This must be crafting, right? What is this? Guys, what just happened? I have a question. Can anyone see what just happened? What did just happen? We went into this dungeon, right? We had a quest. It had to do with going here and, I guess, destroying whatever they were doing. Now, in Diablo 4, what we would have needed to do is go there and then click on it. And then it would slowly fill up a bar of progress until it is deactivated. Not in last epoch, however. You just click on this, it gets destroyed and you move on. Because these people value your time. You missed the prior escort mission? True, yeah, we missed the escort mission, 100%. When can I tell if a skill is high level enough? When do I know that? It's still going. Huh? So you saw the... Uh, I saw you head to the storage. Are they gone? They're gone. Thank you. Never mind that. Rest well. Quest complete. We got a passive point? Oh, wow. We got a passive point. 
from this quest. So if I didn't do this quest, I would have not gotten this passive point. I have to fill out every single map now. Lol. What do we get here? You can dual wield melee weapons by equipping a sword or a dagger in your offhand. You can you take more damage while dual wielding. Mm -mm. Nine percent more damage is not good. Increased dodge rating. Do you take less damage while moving? Yeah. But wait, I can't. Okay, we pick one point here. Shit, I'm I need to respect again, really. Drop a smoke bomb at your feet, builds enemies, grunts your haste while you remain inside it. The smoke bomb grows in size over its duration. Wait, what is with this? Wait, wait a minute. Oh, okay. What is this ability? Cinder Strike. Melee or bow combo with three attacks. The first attack creates a fiery explosion. Uh huh. <laughs> oh wow, 60 damage. Who are you? The Keeper Lina sent me. Keeper Ballista. No, Keeper Balthas is inside protecting the shard. The Ospryx won't be able to pass through the inner door without a, without a symbol of Etera. But they'll break it down before long. I'll take them out. I hit the symbol from them. They left me alone thinking I was already dead. Take it. I will unlock. It will unlock the door. Okay. Ah, uh, yeah. Aha, okay. Wait, we got another passive point? Ooh. Okay, we're gonna go for defense as early as possible because I do not want to die. We'll go for maximum dodge. Damn. I wanna see how this works. Am I invisible in here? No. I wonder if I have more dodge than this. Wait, let me double check. I don't have more dodge. Then what does this do? It blinds enemies, okay? So they, I guess blind means they deal less. Armor, vitality, dexterity, health, lightning resistance. That one's better, for sure. Adds physical, adds X physical resistance. Okay, there's also physical resistance. Okay, well, is this Once important? Once I deciphered the keeper's movements, the vaults were easy to find. Exploring them proved more challenging. Ancient stonework that could inspire even the greatest of Solarum's architects. Nearly impenetrable. Between my engineer's finest munitions and the strength of my pet, we managed to crack one open. Only to find empty halls and vacant chambers. What would be the purpose of such a stronghold if it were to house nothing? Yet I could tell they were here, just as I predicted. They were guarding something of immense importance. Something powerful. Raya will be pleased. I don't understand this. Also, here's a thought. Why do the scrolls have to be clicked manually? Why don't they just automatically activate? 
What is this? Who's this guy? You're here to help! The Osprey slave! Stick at Kane! Yes! Protect the sword! They're coming? The Drake! What's happening? Take carefully! Wait, would I have gotten... Would I die if I had stand, stood there? Uh-oh. This is insane. Sort. We'll reconvene outside. We have a sword. Ah, uh, melee damage. Cold damage, health, enemy, chance to chill on it. We can also use a shield. How is everything a two-handed sword, man? Come on. This doesn't look like a two-handed sword. Look at this little poison raj. Press transfer materials and inventory to store crafting stuff for free. First things first. Thank you. The Osbricks grow more troublesome by the day. We've reinforced our walls, supplied our men, and taken out dozens of them. Yet, they're still here. Using brute force now. Through their drain? The howling monster circling the vault. Yes. Can I beat it? So, I see you like keeper's ropes. I take it Lena sent you. Yeah, she Lovely. did. She's While a keeper. While your help has been appreciated, I have everything under control. What are you doing here? What do you mean? I'm protecting the Epoch, of course. And what is the Epoch? Here. It's a fortress. Meant to keep unruly treasure hunters from locating the shards of the Epoch. What is shards or of Epoch? at least it's supposed to. Drastic. Did Lena not tell you? No, what is that? Well, tell you what. Let's get out of here first, and then I'll explain more. These peace talks are hardly worth it if you don't know why Orion is after us. Who is Orion? I have too many questions, man. You need to answer some, bro. And you need to show me some pictures. Sorry needs a lot of work. Yeah, the story is very difficult to understand and follow. Yep. Uh, whoever, I guess Orion is one of the bosses. Boom! Wow, I crit this guy all the time. Dude. In before he dies, before revealing the secrets. Yeah, exactly. Let's get out of here. Oh. Now, um, is it because you can trade these materials and if you don't want to trade them, you just add them to your crafting materials? And I can't sell them anymore, I guess. Right? Wow. They, they can't touch me anymore. Holy. What is this level? Uh, what's the level in this area? There's a vial. Chance to poison on hit? Wait a minute. Oh, excuse me. Hey, cool! Since the Keepers fall, we've held the same rituals. Instructed to keep the Epoch Shard separate. Those were Itera's words. Okay, so the Keepers keep these Shards separate. The okay, first why? Epoch Shard is held in a fortress. Mm -hmm. Ancient Iteran mechanisms hold it in place. With no one but us knowing how to enter. The second okay. vault is deep inside the Stonefall Mountains. Mm -hmm. With traps that only the keepers know how to maneuver. Oh, of course. The yeah. third shard is always on the move. It uses multiple vaults. Only we possess the knowledge to open them. Okay. This is why we never call a single place. 
Okay, so the keepers, I guess, keep keep these shards, and I'm pretty sure in the story all of the shards will be combined, and then we fight the boss that comes out of these shards. Like Diablo, right? And then in the end, we're going to snuck one of those shots into our head and then we will be Diablo. I can already tell. Alright. We have a new ability to unlock. What do we do? Poison duration per point. Chance to be... Wait. Acid flask has a chance to shred enemy poison resistance on hit. Poison resistance chance 150% per point? But that's more than a hundred percent. How can I have more than 150% poison resistance shred? Huh? The chance is between zero and one. I don't understand this. We go with the poison duration. Okay. That makes no sense. Who are you? Uh, one Let or more? Let me ask, for how long must we live like this? No one cared about the shards until recently. Until Raya. For now it's just him. But how much longer until Lagan seeks them out? Who's Majas? Lagan? Guys, it's too many names. We uphold customs, as it are our will. But our goddess is gone. If she knew the state of the world, would she not request us to act? To bring peace back between her children. We cannot keep the old ways. The council is scared. But nothing, nothing will change, change if we do not change. Okay. If we do not change. It's time to go back and sell items. Wow, the portal is instant. Almost like they learned from Path of Exile. Instead of, you know, having a cast time for your portal. You could just instantly teleport back. Hmm... Isn't that something? Increased mana, armor, minus, no, get rid of this. What is this? Chance to slow attackers, void resistance. Ward gains when damage leaves you at low health. Mm -hmm. Oh wow, interesting. It's an offhand thing. Oh, wow, I didn't even see that. Mage Helmet. See, this is what I mean. That's why I did account found. Because now we can just... This guy here. Oh, we can make another skill be better. Let's do shift. I wonder why we... Healing amount. Shifting heals you. Increased cooldown recovery. Mana efficiency. Melee damage along path. Nah, we don't do that. We do healing or faster. We do this. Awesome. This one's almost leveled up. Awesome. Hey, where's the dude, by the way? He's gone. Cool, another teleporter. Man, this game looks good. Wow. Wait, I wanna check. How do we do a loot filter? Manage loot filters. Filters function by creating rules and ordering them. Rules located higher in the list take priority and overwrite the rules listed below. Import a filter. Okay. Uh huh. Test filter. I thought there was a default filter. Loot filters are very easy. I guess we do this later then. I don't know enough about it yet. I don't want to hide any white items. Maybe there's a white item that is really good and I hide it I'm and sure I'm accidentally... Questions, but let me first check and make sure the epoch's safe. Of course. Who do the keepers adhere to? Our slumbering mother, E-Terra. Alone, 
A goddess a they cannot they see. They sent no treasure to see for Lagon, nor works of art south to Majassa. Were they in league with it? How can they claim a greater connection to its error than us? We're the servants of Raya, the inheritor of her domain. It is blasphemy. They will burn. At some point, you want to hide the white items, though. Yeah, that's the first Good thing we'll we do. No. <laughs> of course. What's now? Okay, the plot device. He couldn't tell us earlier because he had to get captured by fucking dragon. These nuts. What happened? Oh, plot device happened. What else? It was Orion. Okay. It was an Orion. Looks like they went towards the highlands. Okay, I'll handle it. Okay, fine. Wow. What is this? Health region chart. Okay, shards. Pardon if it's not much trouble. Caught one of some soldiers getting lost in the highlands. Are you sure? Okay, whatever. Okay, do we need to look for soldiers. Res Fine. With both us. Uh, both us got carried away by a plot device. What? What happened? Well, he was about to tell me, but then a dragon these nuts came and put him away, so he couldn't tell me that anymore. That must be Orion. So now but I have no clue what's going us. on. Oreo, okay. He's in danger. An Osprey's general. Yeah. He's the one leading the hunt for us. Mm -hmm. okay. What happened to the artifacts Balthus was protecting? Well, we took everything and destroyed it, so it should be safe. That must be what they were after. We have to save Balthus. Get him and the epoch back. The last epoch? Maybe? Their camp is not far. I have to organize a group. Go. Are you sure? Yeah, I can I'll gather go. soldiers. Mm -hmm. Have them come with you. You'll walk into an entire army of us. Yeah, Stay but safe. I'm the main character. Are you Stay stupid? Alive. Don't you understand? Don't I don't die. Back. Goodness, man, these people. Idiots. Holy. All right, this is the time where we go to the right. When I op open this menu here, you can see at the very top, it shows me the area level. But when I close it, I don't see it. Mm -hmm. So we are in area level six and our character is level nine, I guess. We're almost level 10. Oh wow, there's a big guy. Oh no! Oh no! Woo! I almost ran to the wrong way, oops. Almost died. Oy, oy, oy. Okay, okay. Wait, there's two big guys. Wait, we are level 9 now? Goodness. Okay, anything good? We have a one-handed sword that does 22 damage. Hey. Level 20? Hey? Oh, come on. That would have been so cool. Intelligence, hellfire, fire, resistance. Need to get good? Le how can I find level 20 equipment at level 9 in a level 6 area? Can someone explain that? Why is that even possible? Shouldn't level 6 monsters drop level 6 items? Oh wow, what is this? Two of these? What is this? Twenty six damage, holy. Nine damage, cold damage, melee damage. Twenty percent chance. Wait, twenty two percent chance to poison on it. Damage over time. Physical resistance. Wow. 
This one is good. Okay. Wow, these ones, they really dropped some good shit. I gotta turn off the Hello Fresh bot, lol. I still have it on. Okay, I think it's about time that we encounter a boss. I feel like we are strong enough now. The game has been going for a while, we're killing a bunch of random monsters. It's time that we encounter a big boss. Watched soldier, not this guy. A really big one. Is this a big boss? Is that two fort soldiers? Okay, I guess we finished the quest. It was a trap. The Osprex used the bait. Set out a distress signal. They plan to ambush anyone who... And she's dead. Okay. I'm pretty sure we're gonna fight a boss now. Are you supposed to one-shot everything? Or is this not this type of an RPG? I have no idea, man. I feel like I'm a little bit too strong, but I'm also overleveled, I think. So this might just be normal. Decoy. Get a new point. What do we have here? Uh, poison penetration per 5% of uncapped poison resistance. Oh, this is some PoE stuff here. Acid flask has a chance to blind enemies. No, I want to have... Um, I have no clue. Throwing speed, I guess. Or poison duration. What do we have here? I gain 50% movement speed for a brief moment. Duration is 0.5 seconds per point. Okay, that sounds good. Oh, I see. I need two points in this... Then I can go here. Okay, it looks like we're getting into the camp of the enemy. So I'm assuming there's going to be a big boss. Maybe in this area. On the summit? Yeah, there's gotta be a boss in the summit. Alright, wait. Before we go... Do we have any good items? Crit chance, crit damage. No, crit chance, crit chance. Stun chance, stun chance. Melee physical damage. Wow, melee physical damage. Damn. Okay, and we have a new skill point, which means we can go for uh, damage above every third melee, throwing or bow attack and deals increased damage. Dodge and parry, dodge rating plus 6, glancing blow chance, 3% per point. You have an additional dodge rating and chance to receive a glancing blow when hit. And this one is haste. Haste on hit chance. You have a chance to gain haste for one second on hits and deal increased damage based on your increased movement speed. Increased damage per increased movement speed. Hmm, I think this one's good. At least one point until we can get more damage. This looks really good. Decoy. Throw a decoy. Throw a device to create a decoy that taunts enemies around it for 2.5 seconds. I think we'll put this on. Ah, there we go. Again. Okay, I'm pretty sure it's going to get tough now. Yeah. Let's grab the teleporter. For, okay. Let's get ready, guys. There's going to be a boss. You're here for the epoch. Reaching me was impressive. But it's mine. Member Who's this? I can't see anything. 
Oh. Protect this guy, not me. I'm gonna throw some lanterns at you. Look at this. Poison deeps. Poisons. The epoch is ours. Raya, aid me. Ooh, what did he do? <laughs> Holy shit. I wonder if I'm one shot. I don't want to find out, though. Easy. Lol, that was easy. Oh. He's dead, lol. First boss down. Easy! Man, that was easier than I thought it would be. If that is supposed to be a boss... Ah, we're gonna breeze through the game. Level 10 unlocked. Easy. Nice. No. Hell, it is open already. It's open already, bro. Saving Deckard Cain? Yeah, this oh, is Deckard Cain. My knees. Such large creatures, those hospital. I will be, okay. thanks to you. Let me, Let just me grab, grab these knees. nuts. <laughs> Let me just grab these nuts. <laughs> there. The shards of the epoch are safe. <laughs> I was worried for a moment. Oh, I just love this. Okay. You mentioned these before, these nuts? Yeah, the shards of epoch. Okay. And explain this, please. The Epoch. Yeah. Oh, it's Atara's most sacred artifact. Mm -hmm. Holding great power. Mm -hmm. So if I were to combine all three, it would spawn a big boss, I guess? The power to travel through time. Mm -hmm. yeah. If Raya were to get his talons on it, he would surely win the war. More than that, he'd be untouchable. Mm-hmm. Who is Raya? That's like one of the bosses, right? So what now? You mentioned shards. Are there multiple epochs? Yeah. Just one. Each shard is part of the whole. We keep them separated for protection. This responsibility makes the keepers what we are. I guess you keep them safe, right? <laughs> Two of them. The one I keep with me and the one from the vault. Mm -hmm. The third should be back at camp by now. The Heo Brian champion should return with it soon. Who's that guy? Lena sent him after it. Alone. Oh, we got oh, it's the, the guy the guy that we saved earlier or that went with us earlier is going to pick up we're gonna go rescue the guy next. No. No, there's no time. You're carrying multiple, isn't that dangerous? The alternative would be to leave one with Lena, drawing the Ostrich's attention to her. How about you no. give me one? No, I could not let that happen. Um, okay, what now, now? I find a new course of action. Take the Epoch somewhere Raya can't reach. So he has no plan? Which means he's gonna get his shards stolen. Great. Which... Speaking of, let's head back to camp. I must reach Lena at once. All right, let's go. Another one of these nuts. I must remind myself to find suitable provisions for Emberwing. Prey in this area upset a drake's stomach. 
Ulroth. I, I don't well, really care I about this Drake, okay, flight, whatever. Let's go back. But with Ember Wing's aid, I can once again feel the wind. Oh, how I've missed the limitless blue. But to me, it sounds like a setup that his shard's gonna get stolen, the other one loses the shard, and then we have the to fight the big boss. Okay. Anyways, we got experience. Res, That's nice. I wonder if there's more stuff that unlocks as we go through the campaign. Oh, what is this? Dodge rating, minion damage, plus one attunement. Huh? Plus one attunement? Attunement is a stat, like int. Ah, okay, so it's like dexterity and stuff. Okay, thank you. Right. Alright, let's see, where do we go next? Oh, we have a level point here. Poison duration, poison chance. I want poison damage. Is there no poison damage? Mana efficiency. Travel faster. Frailie chance. Causing them to deal less damage. Fire damage. Turns it to fire. Acid flask base damage is converted to fire and it hits equal significantly more damage. Consecu cons consequently, this damage scales with increases to fire damage but not increases to physical damage. Ah, so we change the scaling. No poison chance for pools or pool or poison pools. So that means if I click on this, all of these nodes become useless. Oh, I see poison pools. Ah, we want to go to poison pools. What is this? I didn't even think about this. Acid flask leaves behind a poison pool for four seconds that poisons enemies that stand in it, and adds a two-second cooldown per flask throw. No. Why? Starts aiming explodes when enemies walk over. You can have a maximum of six acid flask traps at once. Hmm, this is like turning it into traps. It's just a different playstyle. Acid, fla uh, acid flask has a chance to shred poison resistance on hit. I guess we'll go for the poison resistance. Poison puts last longer. Chance to inflict enemies with toxin each second, causing them to take increased damage over time. Okay, we go for this. We go for big poison. You can now try... Wait, you can now throw three acid flasks in a line. But they cost more mana. But they can only be hit by... This one together with the pools. I'm pretty sure the pools stack. That's gonna be OP. We go here. And then we go here. Next. Yeah, 100%. So we need to respect it. Ha, uh, if I respect now... Reduces the skill to level 1. Fine. Yikes, yeah, that's really annoying. I'm not sure why the drawback is there, but okay, fine. Where do we go? And no over here, okay. Guys, there's one thing I haven't checked yet. The shop. One one thing that already really I, I like a lot. Look how small the shop button is. You see that? It's like they don't want you to click on this. Okay, so about 10 euros is 100 epoch points. That's how I see this. What is it? Yeah, about... About 10 euros is 100. I thought so. Mm -hmm. How many cosmetics do they have? They don't really have that much, do they? They don't have VFX for skills yet. Yet, they don't have footstep effects. And they don't have portraits. I wonder how much they sell on this. That was impressive quick maps. No, it was like it was a hidden hunch. He's back. 
And it's all thanks he's been mm. quiet since he returned. If you could speak with him, I'd be grateful. I'll talk to then him. Then we okay. can begin. Go back. So now, what now we must protect the epoch. Find a way so Raya won't get to them. Just kill Raya. Can't we kill Raya? Not fully. Eterna left their secrets to us and to us alone. What's your I plan? I have uh, ideas. The we will will disagree, okay. We are keepers after all. Protectors of Eterna's past. You sound sad. Do you think we've made a mistake? Uh, why do you get so offended? I just ask a question. Going through emotions. Keeping the shards hidden, it's... It's, it's all been ritual. Uh -huh. I feel as though drastic times are upon us. And now, you know about them too. Fate has already shown it. I apologize. You might become part of something greater. Of course, we are the main character. I huh? only have two shards, but that's enough. I'll keep, keep them, them safe. safe. Yeah, he's gonna lose the two shards 100%. Lena, I'm sorry. What are you doing? I'm sorry to you Quest too. completed, 100 gold. Why, why not XP? Best for us all. Okay, what now? With the epoch's power. I'm finally able to... Oh wow, what happened? The crumbling ruins. He just left and took me with him. Lol? This is the first interesting thing about the story, man. Cool. <laughs> Aha! Of course, we pick it up now, right? Man, where am I? Ruined area. Area level 9. Wow, this looks good. Dude. It appears to be one of the shards of the epoch that blah 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 had. Balta said. It looks like it has. It looks like it has only been here long, as, as long as you have. Balthas and the other shards are nowhere in sight. Take the shard of the epoch. Okay. What is this place? Ah, uh, so there's time travel. I don't seem to have gone far, but everything looks so different. Is there anyone here? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I feel a little unsafe. They look very dangerous. Avoid. Um... They don't take any damage. Voids have resistances? They seem very resistant to stuff. We just went like a thousand two hundred into the future. Oh, I see the um the top right here, the AG. After something. Oh wow! Who's this guy? Now why don't you help me? Bro? Look at him! He's talking! Or not? Uh, you there, what are you doing so far from the refuge? I have hmm. no idea. Yes, you, why are you here? Where is here? Don't play dumb, only rangers and elders are allowed here. Everyone knows that. What are rangers and elders now, bro? Like, you can explain this shit to me! Cultist? The void leeches of them? The way void leeches of them? And last refuge. This is not to say there aren't any cultists nearby, so let's both be careful. Come, I'll take you back to the refuge. Are you well in the head? Are you well in the head? Look around you. Dark tar it consumes everything around us. The void. Last refuge is the only place to steer clear of it. Okay. Fine. Let's go. We got an ally, guys. I wonder how much damage he does. He's useless. He's completely useless. Just like Diablo 3 characters. Of course. You see that? You saw that? He did 18 damage. Wow, are you dying? 
Komisch. This place is crazy. They don't take any damage. I mean, at least he's regenerating. Right? Are you well in the head, says the guy. <laughs> what are you trying to say, Bush, huh? What are you trying to allude to here? Huh? Oh, nice. Alright, hey, we should start getting more offense, I think. Some attack speed and physique. Oh, that was so bad. Shit, I shouldn't have done this. Hello there. Itero, watch over you. That's not your voice. I uh, God sent me. I came from the outside. Still have you? Still you have a presence about you, as if hmm hmm. Do you have a shard on you? Well, um, maybe. I'm not telling you though. It's a long story. I'm pro How about no? I'll get to the bottom of who, how and why you have it later. What is important is that we pres present this to the council immediately. See? They already want to use it. They didn't even ask me for permission. Whether our wards have fallen by a shard misplaced or simply the foretold holder we have heard so much about. We must find out what foretold holder. Yes, a long story for now. The blah 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 Brevin in the city. We will ensure you are present it to the rest of the elders the elders who are they you're not allowed you're not really from around here we uphold the council the leadership of last refuge why don't you take it to them i'm in no shape to go back there i do not want to face void along the way what a fucking pussy man God. oh i don't want to go i don't want to face any you? issues falling how last refuge is falling how i'm not talking to all of these guys maybe if they are voice acted hell nah all right, let's go. Mm -hmm. Yes. You there are not fighting off the void. Uh, listen, man, just God be with you. Shut the fuck up. Okay. I don't want to read everything, man. I, I hate reading. Easy. Too easy. Oh wow, we got to. Uh -huh. You fought them off too late for me. Outskirts, please help them evacuate. Okay. Wait, do we do the teleporter? Do we pick it up? I don't know if you have to click on it or not. Reading makes that hurt. Like, listen, you, I'm like reading more than I'm playing the game, bro. Are you online? Playing? Yes, I'm playing online. I have connected to the server. Yes. Uh, currently the game... ...plays quite well. I don't have any lags. Nothing. It plays really good. Did you see that, guys? There was another lever. But in this game, you don't have to go through a stupid casting time to activate it. You just grab it by the nuts and then you'll smash it to the left oh wow it's really anticlimactic because it stays there it should completely disappear <laughs> i can still see it man what is this every third melee throwing bow attack deals increased damage i think we want this at least for one point so i don't think this point is wasted i have a feeling the best way to play with this character is to gather up a bunch of monsters and then just toss a bunch of poisonous concoctions in them see that how they all die by the way what is the difference between online mode and offline mode apart from the internet connection is your progress being tracked in some sort of leaderboard no leaderboard for offline okay so there is a leaderboard where can i find that 
<gasps> Are you fucking kidding me? Huh. So this game made by 90 people as their first game has a leaderboard on release? I thought you need five to four, four to five seasons for this. It's probably made by aliens. Let's be sure. Let's be real here, guys. These guys must be from another planet. That just doesn't work like that. You can't have leaderboards and more than six dash tabs in one game. That's impossible. Now I know why I like this game so much. There are no mana flasks. I get it now. You have to manage your mana without flasks. <coughs> Excuse me. Keep them off me. Only a little longer. Only a little longer. Holy, he's gonna die from poison, is he? Damn. Go on. I'll be right behind you. I'm lagging. I'm lagging. I think. No, it doesn't fit in the inventory. Wait, I really want that though. Wow, look at this axe. It's not actually that good. Mm -hmm. Can we sell stuff? Oh, who's that? You may find a treasure, my friend. No wonder the Ella kept this place to themselves. Heal hell of a view. Hmm. Care to try your luck? Found some good stuff on my way up here. Gamble? Oh, hell yeah. But I, oh my god, look how expensive that is. Hell nah, brah. You're too expensive. A thousand? Who do you think I am? Stupid? Hell no. Nah. Alright, we get to sell some stuff though. We don't use staffs as rogues, right? Intelligence, throwing damage. Throwing damage? Increased health regeneration. Hmm. Let's do that. Chance to poison, lightning damage, damage over time. Nah. To me, it looks like the following. The physical part of this ability is only being increased by physical damage. And if I increase my physical damage, I don't increase the poison because the poison is a separate part of the ability. If I get 20% damage, I think this only applies to like the hit, but not the poison. I could be wrong though. Maybe it's explained under damage over time in the guide. Oh, we could check that. Yeah. Damage in last epoch can be dealt in two different ways. As a hit or as, dam or as damage over time. A damage over time effect deals damage to a target. Yeah. The most common some sources of damage over time are ailments such as ignite, bleed, poison, which affect individual targets. There are also damage over time effects which uh, damage targets within an area such as fire aura, tornado, consecrated ground and many more. Any source of damage that is not damage over time is considered a hit. Most damaging abilities include a hit such as swipe, blah blah blah. Hits can be dodged, blocked and turned into a glancing blow. Damage over time cannot be mitigated by most defensive mechanisms except for resistances. Damage over time cannot critically strike and does not trigger on hit effects. Such as health, <gasps> excuse me, health gained on hits. Okay, base damage, damage conversion. All skills have a base amount of damage that they would deal without any stats, which is called the base damage. Base damage can only be modified by skills tree. The default base damage for each skill is listed in its tooltip. Melee's skills typically have two base damage total because most of their damage comes from weapons. Spells and throwing attacks can have much more base damage, but the exact amount varies a lot between skills. When calculating damage dealt, stats like plus 5 melee fire damage are multiplied by the skill's added damage effectiveness. 
then add it to the base damage before starts like 30% increased damage and 10% more damage applied. Holy shit. Added damage without a damage type such as 5 melee damage adds damage of a type that depends on the base damage type of the skill. For example, 5 melee damage will add 5 melee physical to a physical melee attack. Yeah, but it won't add that to poison, right? Base damage type of a specific skill can be converted. For example, a physical skill could be converted to a fire skill. Conversions are typically found in skill trees and items. Mm -hmm. Base damage conversions of a skill base from one type to another which does not affect the damage from stats, stats such as plus 5 melee fire will change the damage type of added damage stats without a damage type tag such as plus 5 melee damage uh, it's getting more it's getting more confusing all skills have an added damage effectiveness which is a multiplier that is applied to all damage stats like five melee fire damage what is wrong with their melee fire damage man skills with large mana costs or cooldowns typically have a greater than 100 percent effectiveness all right what is my effectiveness it doesn't say unless i have to hold alt aha dexterity scaling and damage effectiveness it's down here you have to hold alt i have 52 increased damage Four damage for each dexterity point and I have an added damage effectiveness of 100%. I believe poison is only scaled by percentage damage over time and percentage poison dex int whatever the skill uses. Yeah, that's what I think so too. I can sense that you have a shard of the epoch, but that is impossible. Who are you? The elder Gaspar, how you gained the shard. Tell the Gaspar, okay. I see. We have relied on the power of our shard for ages, always assuming the others were lost. And it seems only tapping into a fraction of its potential. Uh -huh. You were brought forward in time by the shard. If you want to return to your time, we will need to use them together. If the void does not consume us first, of course. What's going on? What's the void? Thank you. Good question. The void fell upon our world hundreds of years ago. All consuming darkness spread across the surface and drove us into these caves. The last city of humanity. Last mm -hmm. refuge. Okay. Now that the void has finally found us, it will reach this place and snuff us out. Now, how are you planning to do, deal Canyon with this? Elder is an expert at using the shard. He can weaponize it against the void. So I went into the time to help them out, I guess. I have accident. received word that his study is under we attack. We may be out of time. Okay, what we are the shards? They are the shards of the epoch. A relic set to A have relic power. set to have power over mm. fate itself. And after hearing your story, I have no doubt in this now. It was broken into three shards long ago. We relied on one of them to sustain this place ever since the void destroyed the surface. Mm -hmm, okay. We thought the other shards were lost. But with yours, we may have hope of surviving this How? everyone here is either too old or too injured. except for you okay Please what am i supposed to do find him and have him return here before something terrible happens okay. please take these idols with you an idol of logon to guard you against chaos and one of a terror to guide you home Wherever that. So it's may like be. a portal scroll or something? But, uh, okay. The gods have long left this world, but their memory will give you comfort. Mm -hmm. Be safe, traveler. Okay. Oh, wow. I got idle slots. What is that? Wait a minute. Idols. This is uh, from. Aha. This is from. Ah, Diablo 2. Chance to poison on hit. Wait, I got unlucky. I can only use one. Wait, huh?
Wait, chance to poison the hit. Void resistance. Increased health cold resistance. I guess we go for the void resistance and the poison. Alright. Cool. Awesome. Uh, okay. Yes. Damn, I can't die now. My research, Immortal Empire. Okay, where am I? Am I in the right location? Yes, I am. Okay, we have to go up. I'm gonna skip this text. Fine. I once believed the shards would be safe where the gods could not reach. In the future, I was mistaken. I find myself in a ruined ear. With only one shard left by my side, my purpose is clear. I must seek refuge, prevent others from this power, and locate the rest of the epoch. You mean the rest what of the shards? When I tapped into this power, why did one shard come with me? Where are the others? Was all of this for nothing? Was this the guy that just went away? And we are reading a note from him. All right, let's see. The poison ticks 21. All right. 21 poison damage. We have 40% increased damage. 19 poison damage. So it doesn't scale with this. The lethal cadence, the one that deals 40% more damage each third attack, does not scale our poison damage. Which means uh, it's useless. Damn, what are these? Void touched? Crazy. This is what I picture Shade 11 looks like. Boom. As it is time here, I am disturbed by this era. Uh, I think it's not a mistake. It is the consequences I of think our this actions. stuff would be great. History is not observed. Shh. It is Shh. made. Shh. We must. Shh. If it was like in Diablo, where the thing would just run and you could just continue running. And you don't have to click. If you read this, I'm gone. I, I trust you all. Yeah. You are mine. Okay, so this guy is dead. I'm pretty sure we have to fight a boss. Some sort of zombie. He looks like me. Holy shit, he looks like me. Look. That's me. Holy! I found myself! What are you looking for? Are you looking for Penion? You already left to take a shard and face the void himself. He will fail. It's too late for us. That's not me. And soon it will be too late for him as well. Too late for everyone. Orbis is already here. Oh, I knew this was gonna happen. Uh oh. Oh, wow. You just wait. The target dummy sucks. It takes a lot of mana. Bruh. Hey, wait, are you healing? No. Double kill. Death? No, no, no. I'm not gonna die to this. They don't seem to be that... That dangerous, really. Yeah. Yeah. 
Yay! Level 14. Oh, wow, body armor. Holy shit, what is this? Health? Minions? God damn it! My minions! Oh, oh. There's another charm. Damn. Okay, where am I supposed to go now? Back? Return to the Elba Gasper and tell him that Elba Pennant is missing. Uh oh. Oh yeah. I'm pretty sure we have to go to the right here now. Panium's students were corrupted. I see. They said Panion was after the shard. Where is Elder he? Elder Panion was here but a moment ago. He took the shard. I told him to wait, but he would not listen. Are you that stupid? I fear the Void is manipulating him. Yeah, then why did you let him leave? Turning his courage into arrogance. He's left to face the void alone. What can we do now? You must intercept Elder Panion before the void claims him and seizes the shard. Knowing him, he is headed where the void broke into the city. Okay. Please stop him. Okay, fine. Um, I need to respec. Where's the brain? I need to get rid of these two points. We can get better points. Greetings. Hello. Uh, we never wanna get. I wanna get rid of this. Yeah. Respect this point and respect this point. These are useless. Which means we can go for. How many points do we have now? Five points. Mm, we can go for haste. Increase damage per one percent. Increased damage per 1% increased movement speed. I wonder if that affects poison too. Wait, I think I can check this out. With C. Poison. Reduces poison damage. Yeah, where's my poison damage? Poison damage, 45. The damage poison deals over 3 second duration. Poison deals poison damage over time. And the first 30 seconds reduce, yeah. I wonder... Oh, it does increase my damage. Increased damage increases poison damage. So, if I take this node, I get more damage. And since we already have decks, that is the best way to get defense and damage. Maybe we should go for our dodge rating though. <gasps> we have ballista! Mana cost. Physical bow attack. Oh man, summon a ballista. Press A to give you minion and attack command. Wait, I have to use it? You have a chance to poison on hit while you have a dagger or bow equipped. I uh, mean, I don't have that. Shit. I guess we'll go for these sapping strikes. Mana. Yeah, we go for sapping strikes first. Do not dwell on oh yeah, and we have this. One point here. Which means we can get that now. And then we have poison pools. We have two points here. Shift consumes a health portion on use if you are below 50%. Mm. Shift restores mana on use. This amount is tripled when below half health. Ooh. Oh yeah. Shifting heals you. The amount of health is gained increased by healing effectiveness. Ooh. Oh, wow. This is really cool. Can I use more? Level 20. Okay. Alright, it's time. Oh, wow. They do the same thing as Diablo 4. Where you can go in three dimensions. Damn. And they didn't need 9,000 people to do that. Interesting. I wonder how. They must really be aliens. Lol. I guess I'm invincible. <laughs> Look at this. It can't touch me. Oh, wow. Hello, boss. What do you mean? Hey. Uh oh. What are these balls? Uh, what is this?
piss off. Uh-huh. <laughs> if this hits me, the game sucks. Okay. Good. Game doesn't suck. Oh, wow. Looks the deeps. Oh. Easy man, look at easy bro. Ancient cavern, what is that? That looks so freaking cool. Wait, am I full? I'm full, I didn't sell my stuff. I'm still entering town. I killed the boss and I'm entering town. Like how long am I supposed to enter this? So this is the problem, right? That... Uh, this is like tell uh oh huh hey? what huh hey? what huh hey? wait i'm confused What is this? Chance to find potion, dodge rating, health regeneration. Ooh. I wanna, mm, I wanna go back. Loot is gone, yeah. Of course. Obviously. Yes. All right. Sell, 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 sell. A dodge, vitality, movement speed. Nah. Nah. Oh, we have armor, mana regeneration, but we don't have main stat, which is bad. Oh, wow. That's a 200 sword that deals 30 damage. Poison chance, but it sucks. What is this? This is a dagger. Chance to blind on it. Mm -mm. Increased mana health, regeneration, poison resistance. Has a lot more armor. Crit chance. But it doesn't have dodge rating. Was mainly trash anyways. Yeah, it, it was, it was. That's true. So, about this one, huh? Hmm. Do we have anything good here? Nah, it's just trash. Um, you know what? I'm just gonna stash these and take a look later. I'll stash this and take a look later. Follow I don't feet. know yet. And I wanna get to Blade Dancer first. Hey? Hey? I'm not killing the boss twice. <laughs> I'm not killing it twice, man. Hey? This is so weird. Where's the teleporter? What is this? Magma Gorn? Holy! These guys are crazy! These are dinosaurs! Look at that! We are in Jurassic World! <laughs> cool! Boom! Oh. 
Do I take damage if I stand on this? No, I don't. That's a little bit unrealistic, guys. You gotta be, you know, I gotta take damage on these. Is he one shot? Is that one shot? It is. Look at this area. Damn. Crazy. It's like Diablo 4, but in actually a good game. I can't believe this. How does this happen? I thought you needed 9,000 people for this. And six years. Damn. Wait. Am I in the wrong location? This looks really interesting here, yeah, this one. This is this creeps like there's gonna be an epic cool thing here. You have to pick it up. Ruin prison. Oh! Whoa, who's this? Who's this guy? Dude? Hey! Who's this guy? Did I do something wrong? I'm sorry. Hey, no, please don't kill me. Relax, relax. You can do it. We're gonna kite. He drops health potions. I think as long as he doesn't one-shot me, we should be good. Oh, shit! What is with this guy? Mage. I see. This is what mages do? Fuck these guys. Go away! Wait, can I kill these? Aha, I can kill these! Eh? Huh? At least he can't one-shot me, that's good. <laughs> Fucking god damn it! Leather boots of defense. Minion damage? Are you fucking kidding me? How more do I get minion damage? I'm not the minion user. Oh. Oh. This game sucks. Scam's dog shit. Scam sucks. It's terrible. I don't like it. We have poison pools now though. Poison pools. There we go. Holy shit, look at this huge pool of poison! Oh, uh, oops. Uh, fine. 
Now I'm assuming... so confused okay how much damage this ability is useless is it actually not useless lol holy shit this ability is crazy it poisons them holy shit I just tossed this thing and I'll move on. Look at this. Oh. How's the game, Mr. Cakes? I like the game a lot. I'm having a lot of fun with this game. I think it's the fact that we, really, we don't have mana flasks. What is this? Wash one? Hey, hello there, uh, Mariko. Ma Marik. By the way, really enjoying the content on your YouTube. Thank you. Keep up. Well, thank you, man. Which YouTube? The, uh, the programming YouTube? Thank you, man. I appreciate it. Very nice of you. Thank you for, for the kind words, man. Okay, I'm assuming... Oh, there's another one. Okay, so the damage only is really strong if they are stationary and stay in the puddle. Or if I can use more than one puddle. So I think the poison puddle in the beginning... It's lagging. Let's continue. The armory. The programming one. Okay, cool. That's nice to hear. Thank you. This doesn't look too good. I definitely feel the server's getting a little worse. Yeah, it's... Not only is it very leggy. Uh, I move and it lags all the time. Um, what am I doing here? What is going on? Um, guys, is it supposed to lag like this? Is this some sort of screen shake? Oh! Holy shit, what is this? Holy moly, he takes a lot of damage. Right, attack this guy, not me. Holy shit! Get away from this guy. You never know. On death effects exist. What's your FPS? How do I check that? F1? I don't know how to check that, man. Oh, I suppose this one's just a small little side boss. Or something? Reach, sir. Reach the lower district located beyond the armory. Okay. Eterra's grace be with you. Hello there. Take care of yourself. Find the quartermaster in the armory. Okay. Will do. Um. Ah. 
Okay, so if I stand still, then there's no, like, stutters. It looks like the game actually hangs. And I don't think it is my computer. What I think is happening is the game's just lagging at the moment. F11 is FPS counter. Oh, hey, recording. Hello there. Okay. Let me check. F11. Yeah, I have... I... Okay, it's it's a little bit like you up and down. Holy. <clears throat> what is this? What is this FPS counter? Holy shit, is this much longer? I really want to become Blade Master. The game looks cool. It is really fun to play, I have to say. The mechanics are really fun. Compared to Path of Exile, Path of Exile is good too, but this one has actual gameplay i would say you have to fight the monsters for real it's not just oh i'm pressing one button and i'm obliterating the entire screen because my build is so good path of exile is more about i would say optimizing your build finding the build that lets you do the things you know like one shot stuff this game is more maybe centered around that too but also more about positioning and attacking correctly at least i think so my build could be that bad that I have to do it. I don't know. <gasps> if I get one more minion ability, one more minion thing, right? What is this? What is this? Is this good? Are you fucking kidding me? Chance to summon a swarm of bees or melee hits. These clothes are found on a million build. <laughs> I found three of them at the moment. I found three good items and they have all been about minions. What is it with this game? Is it like totally random what you get? But why do I get three times minion? Is there like a bug in the game? <clears throat> no, I think that's dog shit. I have to be honest, I think that sucks. Now, I find an item and I get disappointed immediately. Like, I might as well not have found the item. Hey, I dodged that! Are you stupid? I hate these guys. These are like these stupid dudes that toss that spawn uh, in diablo 3 the what are these cards the summoners oh, i hate them so much okay oh hey, we return to ansel okay I find it's cool, these yellow monsters always drop a yellow item. So every time you encounter one of these, you know that you're going to get something. I like that a lot. Nah, I'm not in the mood. The lower district, okay. I think I'm gonna go back to town real quickly, just to get rid of all of the items in my inventory, and then we continue on, because I think... There's gonna be a boss here. Wait, I'm gonna go back. 100% there's a boss. Vitality, fire resistance and health. Oh, if it had dexterity, man. But maybe I should take it because increased physical damage. Maybe I should take this. It gives me armor. What is that? Dexterity, void resistance. Uh. Yeah, these ones. What is this? Is this a set item or something? It is a weird blue. It's not this blue. It's a different type of blue. What is that? One-handed sword. Melee damage leeched. Poison damage. Oh, look at this! Poison damage. I wonder if it's better than increased damage over time. Probably not, right? Get rid of these two. Good chance. 
Oh wow, Primalist, okay. Vitality, fire resistance and dodge rating. I think increased crit chance. Poison resistance though. No, I think this one is still better because of the health regeneration and the resistance to poison. Yeah, what are these? You have lots of shards you can start crafting. I think I'm gonna start crafting next time. I'll keep some of the items. Follow your feet. Oh, we have one point here. Mm, what am I supposed to do here? You are invulnerable while shifting. Is that OP? That sounds OP. Wait, I need three points. Fine. Mana gained? Oh, this is awesome! I gain mana when using this ability. Gods be with you. Uh -huh. Okay, cool, thank you. Stay safe. Okay, guys, it's time. I'm pretty sure we're going to get to the boss now. <laughs> and then we will be blade master. Just like uh, back then in Silk Road, I was a blader. <laughs> we're gonna have a shield and one weapon. That's what we're gonna have in the future. Holy fucking shit, what is this? This is gonna be a boss fight for sure. I can't move. Oh my god, is this my space? Oh no. Stay back. Leave me. I, uh, wait, what are you doing? Leave me. Run. I can feel myself changing. Oh god. Of course. Oh! Holy shit! Um, uh, uh, yeah? Ah. Okay. Oh, eh? Hey. Dude. No. Hey. <laughs> I've seen this in Path of Exile, bro. Can't get me. Why can't I not attack? Oh, I can. I see it. What is this? Uh. Ah! Holy shit, almost died! Oh my god! It does so much damage! Are you kidding me? Uh, what a shame. Yeah, he like oh, literally, I think it was like three ticks and I was down. down to like this much. Holy shit. What is this glowing thing? Hey, he didn't drop any good items. Uh, before you lies a shard uh, that Elder Penion had held, it seems to do, it seems to drive. It seems to drive the void away despite being unable to protect the man himself. The shard you hold resonates in its presence, as though drawn to the one before you. Ah, I see. I hold a shard and it's being drawn to the one in front of me, the other shard, the purple shard. I have a blue shard. Aha. Okay. Question mark? <laughs> what is this supposed to be? Guys, this is the. Oh, I see. They are supposed to telling me. To, they are supposed to tell me we don't know where we are going. Okay, if we don't know that, then we spend a point first. Um, we go for dodge rating and cleansing blows here. How about that? That he, this, he did a little bit too much damage to me. So, can I craft resistances? By the way, 
The forge music mechanic is really good. The forge mechanic? What is that? Yes, I can. Because this guy dealt fire damage to me. And uh, let me see. We Oh, we had 24. And 75. Yeah, we should get maximum resistances, actually. I think that would be number one priority against those bosses. You seem a little disoriented. First time here, traveler. How, how do I get Blade Master? Shut the fuck up. I want Blade Master. This is what is left of your timeline. And many others. Welcome to the end. Yeah, okay, Don't who cares? so surprised. Countless other travelers have come and gone from here. <laughs> I must have looked that surprise my first time as well. Most of them don't last much longer. Jumping around timelines is a dangerous hobby. You should you find chance, Gaspar. You should find your... He might be kind enough to show you how to tap into your true potential. Ah, okay. My true potential is so Blade Master. Where is he? Where is this guy? Hä? Huh? Lol? Lag? Wait. Hä? Huh? Hä? Huh? Hä? Huh? How do I... Stop laughing. I see you laughing. What the fuck? How do I get Stay there? Safe. Shut the fuck up. Huh? You seem a little disoriented. This is what is... Don't... Act. He might be kind enough to... <sighs> show. Stay safe. Yeah, it's... This game sucks. It's dog shit. I don't know what to do. You seem a little disoriented. Oh, oh. First time here, traveler. Stay safe. Yeah, I'm, I, I gotta do something wrong. I'm oh, pretty sure yes. I'm doing something. Holy shit, so much text. Farewell. Monolith of Fate. I don't think I have to go there. Forge. Ooh, that's crafting. We'll do that later. I want to be Blade Master first. Wait, maybe there's like stairs upstairs or something. Maybe there's... Stop skipping lore. Oh my god. Walk upstairs literally telling you. Oh, these stairs. Ah, <laughs> okay. <laughs> I see. Okay, I mean... Huh? Okay, I wanna be Blade Master now. I think Blade Master is a good choice, right? Please tell me it's a good choice. Please don't tell me that Blade Master is only bleed. That is cool. Oh wow, that is cool too. So, by the way, these teleporters, they activate on their own, right? Why is there so many teleporters here? That's too much for now. I just want to be enter the time rift. Is it time rift? Enter the time rift and unlock your mastery. Is this the time rift? Un un okay. Okay, so here we are, and this is level 58. I can't do that. It's the end game maps. Go back. Imagine reading chat. I'm not doing this. No. This is challenge. Guys, I'm not dying for your amusement. Absolutely not. This is level 58. I can't do that. So we gotta find another way. This fucking sucks. This stupid fucking shit. <sighs> go back up the stairs. Okay, fine. I'll go back up. Hey, how? Hey. Why did I get teleported before? 
what teleported me before. Something teleported me. I, hä? Just do it. Yeah, but hä? I'm gonna watch the you video after this. This is weird. That's good. I'm sure you have the loading screen when you click monolith. Questions. It had to load. Oh, so it was this this uh, server thing where it doesn't teleport you right away, but you can still run around in the instance while it's teleporting there, and then it looked like a as I went up. Oh my god. I almost killed myself. I almost killed myself because I was listening to you guys. Hey, go in there, man. You're gonna do the fucking max, bro. Level 58, don't worry about it, man. It's all good. Fucking... <laughs> Oh my god, that was so close. Okay. Oh, this game, man. This is confusing. We woke up. That's good. I'm sure you have many questions. How can you help me? I see you've spoken with the armor-clad woman. She may be flippant, but she intends well. Mm -hmm. Your potential is infinite. Yeah, my Infinite call potential in strength, too. yet at risk of drowning in a sea of other selves. Countless alternate versions of you have come and gone, only to drift away into nothingness. Some of them were strong, and their power can be absorbed, given a new home in you. How do I harness their power? How do I, I become have been the here Blade for Master, a long time. Long enough for time to lose meaning, for my original self. To lose meaning, mm -hmm. I have absorbed the faded selves of too many other Gaspars to count. In the process of the process, adept at guiding the I've shades, okay? If you allow me, I will guide a measure of your other selves to you. This will, this will tie them, okay. I warn you. You must be absolute. Your will must be absolute. Okay. Then close Choose your mastery. eyes um, and focus on the potential you wish to Can I never change the mastery? I guide the shades to you. Can I never change it after I have picked this once? This looks like ranged, guys. No, you can't change it. Never. Hmm. Okay. An artisan of shadows. They dash in and out of the reach of their enemies. Each movement, another deadly cut. Oh, yeah. Maximum shadows. What is that? Melee physical. This sucks. More dodge rating. Multiplicative with other mod modifiers. This is OP. This is OP. This sucks. Because I don't... I guess I deal some melee damage. What is this? Dancing strikes, mana, cooldown, physical, melee, movement, dexterity, series of dash attacks. Dancing strikes, movement does not scale with attack speed. But dancing strikes deals 1% more damage per 3% increased attack speed. This ability is totally useless to me. It is completely useless. What is this? Detonating arrow. That's completely dog shit for me too. <coughs> Fires an arrow. Damage supplies. Arrow. Effectiveness. Explosion. It looks good though. Falconer. The minion uh, items were a hint. <laughs> I'm not doing Falconer now. Summons a falcon. Falcon. You know what this reminds me of? Who of you has played Silk Road? Silk Road Online. Where you can have a falcon as a bowman next to you that attacks for you. It did. It never dealt much damage, but it was still cool. It would literally fly to the enemy and pick on it and deal damage. That's what it, this reminds me of. Silk Road, the drug side, never fucked with that. No, not the drug side. Okay, I guess we'll go with this because of the Max Shadows, whatever that means. What is this? Dexterity... Falcon melee damage per s no. Using a bow attack grants increased attack speed. All stacks fall off after if you have not used a bow recently. Increased damage while using a bow. We're gonna use this. We're gonna do this. Poison. Poison melee. Melee poison? We have a lot of dodge. 
the physical damage we'll see. Yeah. Awesome. Awesome. Dancing strikes. Okay. Cool. What is this? Aha. Oh, what do I have here? Umbral blades. A combo ability that throws two blades, then four blades, then recalls all the blades in the ground back to you. Shadows using Umbro. What does a shadow mean? Let's look at game guides. Shadow. Huh. Weird. I'm confused. Um, shadows using blades always throw a single shadow blade that deals 300% more damage and has 100% increased radius. I want to try out this ability. This looks really cool. Only has 10 mana cost. I don't use this a lot, so we'll switch this out. Um, okay... I don't really gain anything, huh? At the moment. So that's... I just gain an ability. And then maybe some... Oh, we have some other stuff. Wait a minute. 10? What does this mean? Blade Dancer 5? A circular attack that is... That's also used by your Shadow Clones. <gasps> Naruto. Uh-huh. Synchronized strike. Jump forward, strike an area while shadows appear and simultaneously strike at the side of you. Become immune for duration and rapidly strike nearby targets. For how long though? Damn. This is really cool. Have you, have you looked at the other abilities Blade Master gets? You need 5 points in your mastery to unlock the skill. In my mastery? Um, yeah, these these ones, right? I need five points in your mastery. What is mastery? Okay. By the way, I'm, I've already reached the end of this. Kind of sad. What happens after this? Ah! I go into the Blade Master Mastery! Oh, I see! <laughs> I understand now! Aha! <laughs> I get it now, okay. Okay, um, I guess we are not at the end, huh? Okay, cool. Flow. Yeah, okay, fine. Awesome. Dexterity. Oh, glancing blood chance. This is good. Increased damage when consuming flow. You're not limited to just blades answer passives as well? No way. Wait, I could just use that? No way. I can? This game gets better by the minute. What? <laughs> This is so well designed. This is so cool. Wait, I can only go until here, huh? Wait, wait, wait. Aha, okay. I see. I can only go until here because of the chain. We're gonna find poison. Damn. This is so cool. minion damage <laughs> okay bro cool no shit i'm 20 hours in it and i didn't know that what the fuck yeah I, yeah th that is crazy that is actually really crazy that you can do that okay anyways but guys i gotta go now oh, i've been awake since like 5 a.m and i'm really exhausted but Tomorrow we will start with typical game development for like an hour or something. We'll work on the tower defense game and then we'll continue playing this game. So if you want to continue watching 
the last epoch uh, that will be tomorrow after the typical gameplay uh, game development session which will be about an hour anyways i hope you enjoyed the stream guys and i will be online tomorrow